Papa, how do you feel? Mm. <coughs> Sorry, Papa. I saw a girl reach on the way to the stream. He said I should greet you. Mm. 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 Say you should greet him. Mm. Just like that. Mm. So he can't come here again. It's as if Papa is not their brother. It's as if there's no relationship. My daughter, mm -hmm. Onodo came here only once. And she keeps sending messages. Mm -hmm. This world is full of wonders. Mm -hmm. Mama, I suspect those people. I suspect them. You know, this whole thing started. Immediately, Papa finished quarreling with them. My daughter, don't say that. Please, don't say what you are not sure of. I'm sure, I'm sure of what I'm saying. Mama! Oh, oh, oh. I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Mm. Go get the medicine, please. Go. <laughs> this one you will come to my house today. I hope all is well. How is your husband? My, that's why I came home. He's getting worse every day by day. Eh? Please, I want you to come and talk to him. As the elders in the family. He might listen to you. Please, come and talk to him. Let him share the property so that his brothers can leave him alone. Are you suspecting that his younger brothers were responsible for his sickness? No, I didn't say anything, no. I didn't say anything. <laughs> I don't think so. You see, I am suspecting that your husband may have stepped on a powerful medicine prepared elsewhere. Prepared elsewhere? For who? By who? It's an adult doctor. What is this now? What is the meaning of this? What is the meaning of that? Eh? Why would I hold you? Why would I hold you? Are you gone? What do you mean? All I know is that I am innocent. I am innocent. Go to your house before you start running your mouth. After advising your husband to seize his brother's property, now you want me to come to advise him to release it to them. Mama, Mama your food is burning. Receive it. How come your food is burning right here and you didn't even notice? Are you thinking again? Or you're crying? Mama, is it about Papa? Rebecca, everything is about your father. 
None of us gets my brother to come and visit him. Each and every one of them has a nasty thing to say about him. I don't know why he's so stubborn. I'm gonna let them say now. Let them say they're not God. But is he really stubborn? At least they see him as such. I think um, we should visit the herbalist to find out what is wrong with him. Okay. It is necessity that takes one to such places. Okay? So do you want me to start making arrangements? You have to. The medicine one you can give to us does not have any effect on his leg. Mama, everything will be alright. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. in the shoe job I will finish. God forbid. I feel guilty I did not go to see you because when he was sick. Hey. I traveled to the city to see my son and his family. <sighs> if I were home, I would have taken a boko to Agoncha, the powerful native doctor. Ichia, tell us how did it all happen? No, just that his leg started swollen. Swollen? All of a sudden. Turned into another thing. Eh? Hi. Each time I try to visit you, something kept telling me, "Don't go, don't go." Hmm? Why? Why would you go? His wife kept threatening everybody. Everybody. Was she suspecting you? Shh. I'm getting closer to the place. Eh? Find your face. Mm. If you can bring out the ass, go ahead and bring the ass. Mm. Let's go. My brother is gone, DK is gone. Hey! 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 Oh, <laughs> 
my brothers and kinsmen. My kinsmen, I called you out here because I don't know what is happening in this house now. In fact, as I stand here, my heart is boiling. No, 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 no. Please, let us go and sit down. I don't want people to start thinking that we are holding another meeting outside where we are here. Please. Uh, let them think. I saw what if they think we are holding another meeting. Eh? Now, what I want to tell you people is that from what is going on, you have discovered that Mwite killed our brother Iboko. The wife killed him. It's oh, too obvious. Alija, thank you for reasoning fast. Mwite, that woman must answer Christian from us. She strategically made her husband to withhold all the family properties our late father, Ichie, while they were left for us. Now, you, it is obvious. It is obvious she killed Iboko so that her son will become an automatic owner of those properties. Please, 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 en en enough of that. This matter should not even come up today at all. Our brother Iboko is there lying dead and you are talking of property. Whose property? I'm suspecting both of you. I'm beginning to suspect you. No, no, no. You shouldn't even talk about suspecting anybody. I just say I should talk to you, my king's men, as the first son of the family now and the head of this family as well. Because I will soon start acting you as the first son now. Chai! Ichi e mwadi mwe u akuto boroga wada ofisunja. Akuto boroga. I wish you can come back to life and see what is happening in your family. Hey! Just only eight months you were gone. Your first son followed you. Hey! Onye na ema iya. Onye na ema iya. Onye na ema iya. Adiliyama. Hmm. Alite, come on, come, come, come. I want to see his body. Okay, he's yeah. still inside the room. I want them. to not impress. I want to have this. Uh, now, Alicia, let's talk. Tell me the truth, Makatu Binibe, who killed the Boko. I don't understand this question. I don't understand my question. I don't. I think you killed the Boko because of the family misunderstanding. And now you have ended up complicating the whole issue because his wife is suspicious. Ichie. I think it is only a poor to put to here. That was what you advised me on. Now you are trying to blame me. Did I advise you to go and kill your brother? Did I? Now that you did him, go and eat up his flesh. Is this how you are? Ichie? Is this you? My friend, stop pretending. You killed him. Just because of that misunderstanding you had with him. Now, let me advise you. His wife is very, very suspicious of you. So the best thing you will do is to find a way to plan so that you will suck her from that compound. Hmm? Suck her and you will come back. You know your father has so much properties scattered all over the places. You will now come back and share those properties with your younger brother Arnold. <laughs> yeah, Ichie, you are a very intelligent man. I will do exactly what you said. Hi! <laughs> um, now, I ask you again. Who killed Ichie? We are not here to look at your face, whether it is red, yellow, green, or white. Why we are here is for you to answer us correctly, so that we know the way forward. That's it. You killed our brother. 
Goko, isn't it? Did what? Are you denying it? Eh? Woman, this is not the time to shout hey or whatever. We are not even asking you, we are not even suggesting. We are telling you that you killed our brother Iboko. Ha, Iboko, our caring and beloved brother. You killed him. Because the first thing you did was to uh, put quarrel among us, cause confusion. And while we are quarreling, you now had the plan and killed him. Well, tradition demands that you have to pack out of this compound with your kids until we, the family members, complete our investigation and consultation with the oracle on what to do next. Period. You must face the consequences. Aliche, I, with, killed my husband. Are we here for question and answer section? No. I'm telling you that you have three days. Three what? Three days to leave this compound. Unless you want to come with us to Wangene, God forbid. To take an I will never do such. I said it that she was the person that killed Iboko. If not, she will agree to go with us. What's the meaning of this? Huh? What is the meaning of this? Hmm. What do you want from my mother? You want her blood? You want to kill her like you killed my father? What? But why do you want to make her cry? Haven't you done enough damage? Haven't you? You go around the village telling everybody that my mother killed my father. Why did the actress says you did? What? what? Rebecca! You. Me! Yes, yes. you! Me, me. Ah. Hey! Hey! Sacrilege! You are the one committing sacrilege! Do you know what you just did? You pushed an elder down! That is abomination! Hey, you people killed my elder brother and now want to kill the next one! Hey! You know this? Eh? Where? Where are you from? Polika? Are you a Polonia? With you? The three of you? The battle line is drawn! No retreat, no surrender. Let's go. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Mama. Mama, it's okay. Okay. It's okay. Don't worry, tomorrow you go and meet Uncle Jay. And you explain all these things to him. Okay? Are you home? Wait. What is the problem? You are not supposed to be seen moving around in this morning dress. Eh? Your husband just died recently. Mm -hmm. It's my husband's brothers. They came to the house and accused me of killing my husband. They even said we should pack out of the house. Eh? Unless I follow them to one Geneva and Soka to take a note. If you know you are innocent, why are you afraid of the oracle? I'm not saying that I'm guilty. It's just that I don't know what they planned on the way to the place. Now my life is in danger. Eh? Come and rescue us, please. Let me not pretend. I know your husband's brothers have been suspecting you. You see, if you know you are not guilty of the allegation, then follow them to the shrine and swear the oath. Eh? If you come back alive, Hey, hey. All of us will move in a ceremonial dance, accompany you to your husband's place. Yes, that is the way it is done. Now, what do I do now? Eh? As it stands now, you must have to move out of that house, pending the oath taking day. Hey, Chimo, where do I take my children now? Where do where, where do we go to? Eh? Oh. You asking me? To my house, of course. Is there anybody living with me? What? Why are you looking at me like that? Eh? If worse come to worse, as the traditions demand, you will be my wife. Oh, yes. You know, your husband's brothers, they are not interested because of their wayward lifestyle. Yes. They are not even interested. 
Don't you know that your husband's brothers, they are afraid of me? How? Wait. Whenever I see you, I see the picture of my wife. <laughs> the one that will be the mother of my children, you know? The next generation of my children. You see? You know that since my wife died, I've been living here all alone. A miserable fellow with nobody to quench the, 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 the hammer time, hammer time his for me. Now, please stop it. Stop it. Eh? Don't you know that you're a grandfather? See all your children are in the city living with their families and you're here talking about marriage now. Hey! Let me blow, let me blow your nose for you. Tata, little girl. See what you're doing a fresh widow. It's not fair. Eh? Our wife, it's not fair. See what you are telling an old widower. Eh? Is it fair? Is it fair? Since my wife died, I told you, oh, nobody, I've been living alone. Now I'm telling you something that will benefit both of us. You are telling me that it is not fair. What is fair about the fairness? Ichie! Ichie! Who is that idiot calling my name? Are you the person that gave me that name? I, or are you my mother that, my mother that gave me that name? Ah! Look, look, look at this wicked woman. See, did she come here to complain or what? Look at Alice's West. Look at this woman's me. son pushed him down and wounded him. She came here to complain that you people asked her to pack out of the house, pending when she uh, takes the oath. Ah! Wait. You, you, you didn't tell me this one. Nay. It was when he tried to beat Rebecca that uh, Paleka pushed him down. You and Onodu went to your late brother's house to beat up the children. Why? You won't understand. Ota, Ichie, I don't have much to say. Mwite, do you think you can cage Ichie the way you caged our brother? That your charm will not work. It will not work. Ichie, Mwite is packing out of that house. She is packing out of that house. Iwe is aware of this issue. Woman. Did you tell your son to hit him? Hey! You people are complicating issues for me. Ha! You go to the house and stay. You must be here till we finish with this case. Nige, no, 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 no. She will not remain here. She will not come here. She will not stay here. She will be cast out of this village. That is what Igwe said. Hey! My God, I finished. Oh. So you people went to the palace to mysteries and cast me. Hey, the maker of all. You and Ronald went to bed. This will work because we just want just like the rest. Ah, it's in my waist. It's been. Can you see it? Do you do not see it? See the wall. But what you said now? Before the husband died. What was her role in the family? Hmm? This woman used Juju to catch everybody. Conspire with the husband to seize our property. As if that was not enough. Even catch me at, I look at me up the now not married. Because of that. Iche, Iche, I wish you and daughter were present to witness how this woman ganged up with her children to attack us just because we came to make inquiries. Yes, and eh? indirectly telling me that I don't have children. Eh? Hey! Eh? Hey, it, 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 give him seats now. Hey! Eh? Please, before you go in, do you have a alabuku or let's talk to you? To eh? massage his waist. A, um, can you help him? him? Just something that he can use to massage. Well, we'll leave you for the ah, yes, go. Uh, wait, wait for Panadol. Ah. Uh. Igwe, Igwe, wait, is here to see you. Wait, Igwe. I 
It's all right, wipe your tears. It's okay. How may I help you? Igwe, you already know my story. My husband's brothers want to take care of my children out of the house. Because you killed your husband. If you didn't, why are you refusing to go and take an oath before the oracle? Igwe, I did not kill my husband. I have no reason to kill my husband. Please believe me, Igwe, please. You're my last hope. Please. Is that why you asked your son to go and fight them? Igwe, I did not talk. Igwe, please. Pico, I did not. Look at me, please. Pico, 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 Igwe, I did not. I did. Why can't people say the simple truth in this village? Please, I did not do anything. I did not do such things. Look at me, Igwe. How can I? How can I? Igwe? How can I? It was when I literally tried to grab my daughter and I stopped pushing her. That was it. That was it. It's going about creating my depression. Please, Igwe. Please, look at me, Igwe. Look at me. I'm just a fresh widow going from one place to another seeking for justice. Please, Igwe. <laughs> You know what? Go and come back tomorrow. When everybody must have gone to inform my kids. <laughs> there is something we need to discuss. It went tomorrow. Tomorrow. Now train our things out tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know what else to do. I don't know where else to go to. I don't know what to do. Oh, please, Igwe, help me, please. Igwe, help me, oh, help me, because... <laughs> it's a it's a Chimo, 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 <laughs> what am I done? What am I done? What am I done? I give you can't do to my It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Um you see the way things are now. You can bear me witness that uh, I have not taken a new wife recently. Why don't you come and become my wife? You're a very beautiful woman. A beautiful woman like you is supposed to be in the palace, not out there. In fact, the gods have destined you to be here. And if you become the next queen, your ex-husband brothers will come here and bow before you. And again, if you want me to revenge for you, I'll do that just very fast. Igwe, my husband just died three months ago. And you are telling me this. Hey, Igwe, hi. If you agree to be my wife, we will do marriage next year. And we can equally organize a befitting burial for your late husband. Hmm? Igwe. Is this what I want to do to justice? No, 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 no. It's just that I love you. Hmm? It's okay. Hmm? Very fresh, very beautiful. Maybe you are if you are there. The balance of money. Never do. At if you are there. I'm not trying to walk out on you. I'm going. Thank you.
bring out their, their, their clothes. Eh? Do not offend the oracle. I don't want us to offend the oracle by bringing out things that are not necessary so that we do not offend the oracle. Eh? Very eh? good. Now you people will just leave this place and go to wherever you like. We are coming back here in the evening to seal this place with a special object from the oracle. And I warn you, any of you that steps into this compound again will go mad. No, please, no, please. Please, no, it's late already. It's all right. We'll go in the morning. The oracle said it was leaving the dark. So you have to go now. I say leave, eh? Please, now. Please, it's the oracle, not me. Please, no, it's late. Look at me, 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 look don't push anybody. But you people should leave so that Oracle will not. Oracle. Just leave and go back to Oracle in your Oh, <laughs> 
Finally, they'll send you back in, huh? Mm. Nine. Hmm? At least there's enough room here. Hmm? People will come in. I don't mind those your husband brothers. Hi! This is inhumanity to humanity. Nine. Anyway, accommodate them. Go ahead and give them a If there's anything this woman knows how to do, must. He's making trouble where there is none. God will pay everybody according to their deeds. Just accommodate them. Hmm? You have to come in and rest. Hmm? Okay. Okay. Sorry, my sister. Okay. Hey! Welcome. Welcome. Hey! I will not agree to that. How dare you say you will take it? I cannot are you mad? Are you stupid? Who are you? I'm talking, you are talking. Are you mad? Bet me. I will not stop making noise here. Let one person talk and allow his brother to talk so that I will know how to come into the matter. That's exactly what I'm saying. I am his elder brother. I should allow me to talk first. That is what I'm saying. Is it because he is my elder brother that is why he will be treating me like a fool? Mba! It is not possible. He cannot be treating me like a fool that way. I am not a small boy. I am grown up. How can you just take three plots of land to yourself? And I mean, I don't know. How many plots of land do we have? He cannot just come and take three plots of land to himself. I'm very, very greedy. Sit down. <laughs> why not you take two? Plus of land and allow your brother to take two. I don't know why you people are quarreling over nothing when there are many things to be shared in your family. Eh? Don't you know that the family compound that your brother's wife left is among the ones to be shared? The old family compound eh? and the, uh, uh, the other land uh, 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 at the plantation. Iche, 
I don't know you know our family properties like this one. I'm going to go again. Why not? Am I here, Do you see? This is how you ask stupid questions, eh? Very hopeless questions. No, um, yeah. I think you people should take this matter to Igwe. Eh? Let him settle it. Igwe? Mm -hmm. eh, 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 don't go there. Not, don't even mention I with Igwe. No, 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 no. Don't even go there, please. Land issues that go to the palace, Igwe seizes the land. Mm -mm. Most of the people that have gone to that palace with issues like this, <laughs> do you know what Igwe tells them? Tell further notice. And that is how it ends. This issue will not go to the palace. Instead, let her lead you. Take the three plus of yeah. land. Eh? But me, I am taking the main building, the trees that are planted there, including the palm plantation. Shut up! Eh? Are you stupid? How dare you say you will take the palm plantation? You, you see this greedy boy? Have you seen you it? You see how greedy he is? I don't know why you people are still making noise here. Hey! Eh? Do you know that you are? Elder brother's son is still alive, and that means a serious threat to both of you. You've made me kill Iboko. Are you sending me to do it? No! 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 I am not understanding anything. So you did it. Hey! No! 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 You sent me to do it. Are you not the one? Yes. That I sent you to go and kill your brother and chase his wife away. Ichi, please, lower your voice. Yeah? Lower your voice. Uh, no, you have to understand. Me understand? Understand what? So you killed Ibuko? Hi, 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 hi. Hmm, the most one is a fool. Um, Ichie, we have to go now. Um, I'll go home and discuss with my brother. We will come back later. Uh, no, de. we have to go. Emana is a common age. You cannot confuse me with that father. Mm -hmm. uh, you can go. Go. Let's Don't touch me. Ichie, we we'll come back. No, de. Strike all that of his mind, out of his sanity. As it goes, strike him. You are hiding. You are hiding. I want but I say go. Go and strike him. Go. Let him go mad. Wherever he is, let him go mad. <laughs> Understand me better. That 
blue man in your house is full of evil. Yes, she committed serious atrocity in her family at compound. And blue woman are gathered to ostracize her. Your husband, just to show he is righteous, took her in. This tradition forbids anybody accepting her, does it? You are throwing that question at me. But Nai, you shouldn't be discussing this with me, rather my husband. Your husband is foolish. In short, he is an idiot. Hmm? Sorry, I'm not trying to insult him. But I'm trying to present the fact the way it is. You see, I choose to talk to you because you are the one to understand me. What is the news everywhere? Ichia Akama has taken a second wife. Eh? No. Your husband has coveted uh, Iboko's wife to his second wife. <laughs> One day she will be pregnant and you need to, not to be told who is responsible. God forbid. No. Please. Mm, don't go yet. I will talk to my husband. I don't know the matter has gone this deep. Now you know. Better talk to him. Because I will organize our own kinsmen against your husband's kinsmen. <laughs> and <laughs> you will not find it funny. Talk to my husband. Please. You know my place is very far from me, oh? Mm. I really appreciate you. I really appreciate you. Thank you. Mm? Better talk to him. Thank you. Don't you know me again? Hey! Don't you know me again? Don't you know me? Don't you remember? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Look at me. Don't you know? What do you want? Hey! Honor. Honor. Don't you know me again? What a terrible fit. Hey! You are who? Mm -hmm. uh -uh. Abomination. You talk as if you don't know what is happening in that family. First, their father died. Next, the elder brother. Now, Honor is mad. And you want me to go where with you? Abomination. Hey! It's not me and you. It's not me and you. I'll still find a way and go and talk to his elder brother. You must go. You can't leave him there. Uh -uh. Mm. <sighs> Before I accepted to harbor this woman and her children, I consulted with you. And you accepted also. Why this sudden change of heart and attitude? No, she has to leave, that's all. That's my stance, she has to leave. I, I, I've heard enough gossip. Enough of all this gossip, she has to leave. Period. What gossip are you talking about? No, I don't believe this. So you're just the only man in this town. They have not been hearing it. That my husband has gotten married to a second wife with her kids. Fair. Says who? 
says who? Now in let me ask you. Did you actually did, did, did you pay this woman's diary in my back without consulting me? Just tell me the truth. I want hey, I'm your wife. Oh. I will understand. Just tell me. Did you pay her diary without consulting me? Just tell me the truth. And that's all. No, you are not a trouble person. Nah, leave me alone. Let me spread that scene. Leave me alone. Nah, please leave me. Eh? This is not the wife I knew I married. Just tell me what I want to hear. Eh? Are you out of your senses? Tell me, let me hear. Eh? Can somebody tell me you still have your right frame of mind? Eh? In the absence of any strange discovery from your medulla oblongata. Eh? I must say that you are stupid. Eh? You are stupid. Nay, you're yes. calling me names. You're calling me names because of that woman. You are calling me names because of that woman. Listen. She must leave this house. She must leave this house, oh. If you don't have human sympathy, I have one. Okay? Eh? You and I saw what this woman was passing through. Eh? From her late husband's brothers. Me. I didn't, see, I didn't see anything now. Uh, I didn't see anything, please. Yeah. But I'm sure you also saw, saw what she was passing through from the general public. I didn't see anything. All the humiliations, all the sufferings, and all the evil punishment meted on this woman. Still, you hardened your heart. And you are talking like this. I must say, you're not less than an animal. Animal! All I'm telling you now, she needs to leave my house. That is it. That's fine now. All this while, I never like knew. Eat your food. I never like knew food. I am living with, with an animal in the name of a human being. Take this nonsense out of my sight. I don't want to eat again. No, yes, you don't want to eat. Take it away from my sight. Take it away. <laughs> Hopeless, stupid. Look at her. J just look at her. That's exactly the mother. I see the mother in her. That was why that hopeless woman killed her husband. I will not die the way your father died. Idiot. You cannot force me to be here. Nonsense. Hello, look at you, man. Oh, no, 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 no sympathy. No, 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 no. Hey! Oh, no, 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 no. Mama, someone told me yesterday that Uncle Onodo is now a madman. That he was seen around the village, walking around, talking to himself, picking things on the road. Who told you that? Onka, Ikeru's friend. He said he couldn't even believe it himself when he saw him. But he saw him again doing the same thing. Why on earth is he mad? Do I know? Mama, it could be the reward of evil. You never can tell. Those people in our father's family, they are very wicked. They are evil people, so anything can happen in that family. I'm not surprised. But why are you sounding like this? Are you taking pity on him? 
No. I'm thinking of uh, how to start a new life here. I want to meet uh, Maziaka and see if he can help us with a small piece of land so that uh, we can start farming like every other person. Then from there I can start a uh, trade. What do you think? Well, that is a very good idea. And you know Nkwago Market is very close to this place. We can always go there, buy some food stuff, come down here and sell it in the evening market. That way we'll always have enough money to take care of us. Okay. You need a new life. Tomorrow, so I'll meet him and see what he says. Okay, Mama. Oh, yeah, We're almost done here. Mm. Let's hurry up, boss. Nay, thank you so much. God bless you. Thank you. I'm so grateful. Eh? I promise you, I will not disappoint you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Just want to stand up first. Stand up. Stand up. Don't kneel down for a human being. You kneel down only for God. Yes. I'm only doing what I'm supposed to do. I'm only being uh, doing my work as a as a good citizen of this country. Thank you. You're supposed to be helped. You need my help, my Thank assistance. You. Thank yeah? you. God bless you. Yes, for I have us. To. It's my Thank duty. you. Thank you. Rebecca. 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 Yes, Mama. My daughter, come. come. Uh, Mama, is everything all right? Yes. I want you to thank uh, Nai. He has given us a piece of money we can start farming. Eh? Yeah. Oh my God, Uncle. Thank you. Uncle, God bless you. God bless you. You're a good man. You're a very good Just man. God bless you. We need down on this floor. I know that uh, he gave us uh, money to start a uh, business. Uncle, I don't know how to thank you. Just rise. Uncle, thank rise. you. Don't lay down Mommy. before man. It's only God you bow to. Thank I'm you. I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. I deserve my help. I'm only doing my duty. God will pay you back. God will, pay. God will enlarge you. Hey! I heard it. Settlement indeed. Settlement indeed. So this is your plan. Wait. What this is wrong is... with you? Allow me to talk. This is your plan. I... You've actually come here to settle. Hey! I thought you were actually coming to stay a few days and go. So this is your plan to settle in my home. You actually came to settle in my house. You came to settle in my husband's house. And see what you want. Stop it! It I... won't work. What did I do? Hey! I accepted you with my whole heart. You are here to snatch my own husband. My own husband from me. And after the goodness I've done to you. Why don't you have to hey, come up pity for, for this window? I Who's pity? Which window? And whose children? What pity? Huh? Eh? You've not told me what you have with this woman. And, and you must tell me. You must tell me what you have with this woman. Well, well, Instead of giving her land. land. Hey, now your land. Land. And we wanted to do business. Look at you. You're not ashamed of yourself. And what's your you, you gave her money to do business. What's your worth? You must tell me what you have with her. Talk to your mother. Talk to her. This is not your father's house. You do rocks out of nonsense. Enough. Rubbish. I say Talk enough. To, I won't. Hey. Okay, I'm going to And it's still an, an adult. God. You don't seem the best of you. Hey. Woman! Woman! Only good! Good for one thing. Just for the sake of children. Without this, no man will venture into this project of woman. After you walk out, Obasi, I will through with you. Listen, one day God will expose all you evil men in this village. Huh? Starting from you going inside. Go and tell him that I said so. That I should go and tell him what? That I said so. Do you know that Awaiwe is a very wicked man? Is this a pretense or what? No. No, 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 no. I'm telling you the truth. Do you know that? Iwe is interested in Ibuku's wife. In fact, I don't know why he likes women so much. Hi! Now listen to me and listen good. As far as I'm concerned, both of you are partners in crime. If he has sent you to come and fetch words from my mouth, go and tell him that you didn't see me. But, as always, she will leave my house, but none of you 
I say none of you evil men will know peace. No, it's a promise. Go. Mama, let me go and tell you the simple truth. No, you are too young. Please. I know if you see an elephant now, you can kill it. But please take it easy. I don't want those people to see you. I don't want them to do anything to you. Please, my son. Be go, mom. Eh? Mama. Be go. Mama. Mama, every time you are still a kid, you are still a kid. Mama, do you, did they tell you that anybody is going to kill me? They can't kill me. Mama, let me go and talk to that woman. Polika. Polika. Where is he going? He said he wants to talk to Mazakama's wife. About what? Ponikap is not happy. He's not happy about what is happening now. I don't want to lose that boy. He's too young. Mama, let him go, Joe. What is all this? Why do you always feel this way? Ponikap is, is a grown man. Okay? He's grown up enough to know what is good and what is bad. Let him go and speak some sense to some people. I'm sure somebody is using that woman to cause trouble in this family. You don't have to cry. Mama, why do you always feel this tender? Eh? I don't want to it's good though. Oh, it's good that he's the one going. Because if I go by myself, Mama, what I'll do to them, eh? To them. Mm -mm, it's not. It's too young. Mama, please, what do you want to do? You don't want to face his father's enemies. I don't want to. See, see Mama, they're very lucky. If I use my hand and go there and go and talk to her, Mama, you know it's trouble now. You know what I can do. Let him go and talk to her. He will not see what happened to him. Not see what happened to him. He's, he's a grown man. Okay? You bother yourself too much, Mama. Let somebody speak some sense into them. This, I'll go there. I'll go there and show them my color, Mama. I'll be keep it quiet because of you. Don't worry. Everything will be fine. Thank you so much. God bless you. Thank you. I'm so grateful. Eh? I promise you, I will not disappoint you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Just one thing. Stand up first. Stand up. Stand up. Don't kneel down for a human being. You kneel down only for God. Yes. Eh? I'm only doing what I'm supposed to do. I'm only being uh, doing my work as a, as a good citizen of this country. Thank you. Eh? You're supposed to be helped. You need my help, my Thank assistance. You. Thank eh? you. God bless you yes, for us. To. It's my Thank duty. you. Thank you. Rebecca! 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 Yes, Mama. My daughter, come. Come. Mama, is everything all right? Yes. I want you to thank uh, Nai. He has given us a piece of money we can start farming. Eh? Yeah. Oh my God, Uncle. Thank you. Uncle, God bless you. God bless you. You're a good man. You're a very good Just man. God bless you. We need that. I know that. Uh, he gave us uh, money to start a business. Ah! Oh my God! Uncle, Uncle, I don't know how to thank you. Just rise, Uncle, thank rise. you. Don't lay down Mommy. before man. It's only God you bow to. Thank I'm you. I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. I deserve my help. I'm only doing my duty. God will pay you back. God will, pay. God will enlarge you. Hey! I heard it. Settlement indeed. Settlement indeed. So this is your plan? Wait. What this is wrong is, with you? Allow me to talk. This is your plan. Huh? You've actually come here to settle. Hey! I thought you were actually coming to stay a few days and go. So this is your plan to settle in my home. You actually came to settle in my house. You came to sit in my husband's house. Until it won't work. Stop it! It won't work. What did I do? Hey! I accepted you with my whole heart. You are here to snatch my own husband. My own husband from me. Goodness, I don't know. Why please thank him? Hey, Which pity? Which window? Which pity? You've not told me what you have with this woman. And, and you must tell me. Things. You must tell me what you have with this woman. But instead we're of giving her land. land. Hey, now nah, land. Land. And money to do business. Look at you. You're not ashamed of yourself. And what you want? You gave her money to do business. What you want? You must tell me what you have with her. Talk to your mother. Talk to her. This is not your father's house. You do rocks out of nonsense. Enough. Rubbish. I say enough. I won't. Hey. God! Hey! Woman! Woman! Only good! Good for one thing. Just for the sake of children. Without this, 
no man will venture into this project of woman. As you walk out, Omas, are you through with him? Listen, one day God will expose all you evil men in this village. Huh? Starting from Igwe himself. Go and tell him that I said so. That I should go and tell him what? That I said so. Do you know that our Igwe is a very wicked man? Is this a pretense or what? No. No, 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 no. I'm telling you the truth. Do you know that Igwe is interested in Ibuku's wife? In fact, I don't know why he likes women so much. Hi! Now, listen to me and listen good. As far as I'm concerned, both of you are partners in crime. If he has sent you to come and fetch words from my mouth, go and tell him that he didn't see me. But, as for we there, she will leave my house. But none of you I say, none of you, evil men, will notice. No, it's a promise. Go. Mama, let me go and tell them the simple truth. No, you are too young. Please. I know if you see an elephant now, you can kill it, but... Please take it easy. I don't want those people to see you. I don't want them to do anything to you. Please, my son, be go, mom. Eh? Mama. Be go. Mama, Mama, every time you are still a kid, you are still a kid. Mama, do you, did they tell you that anybody is going to kill me? They can't kill me. Mama, let me go and talk to that woman. Polika. Polika. Where is he going? He said he wants to talk to Mazakama's wife. Even what? Polika is not happy. He's not happy about what is happening now. Hey, I don't want to lose that boy. He's too young. Mama, let him go, Joe. What is all this? Why do you always feel this way? Polika is, is a grown man. Okay, he's grown up enough to know what is good and what is bad. Let him go and speak some sense to some people. I'm sure somebody is using that woman to cause trouble in this family. You don't have to cry. Mama, why do you always feel this tender? Huh? It's good though. Oh. It's good that he's the one going because if I go by myself, Mama, what I'll do to them, eh? To them. Mm -mm, it's not. It's too young. Mama, please, not see what happened to him. I don't want to face his father's enemies. I don't want to. See, see, Mama, they're very lucky. If I use my hand and go there and go and talk to her, Mama, you know it's trouble now. You know what I can do. Let him go and talk to her. He will not see what happened to him. Not see what happened to him. He's he's a grown man. Okay. You bother yourself too much. Let somebody speak some sense into them. I'll go there. I'll go there and show them my color. Mama, I'll be keeping quiet because of you. Very much for your hospitality and thank you for listening to gossips. I hope your mother didn't send you here to come and insult me. Hmm? This is no matter of insult. See, let me tell you, all of you who make things difficult for my mother in this is Ujaba land. We surely use your teeth to eat dry dust without seeing your mother to quench your taste. Bet me, bet me, my mother is suffering today, but tomorrow is going to be another person's turn. Who is that person going to be? Polly, my son. I hope those courses are not meant for me. Hmm? I'm only a human. Tell me, what do you expect of me? After listening to the gossip concerning your mother and my husband. Hmm. You just have to stop crying. No? Hmm? You just have to stop. Hello? Yes? Why are you pretending to be good? Why are you trying to pretend as if you're sympathetic? Huh? Why are you asking him to stop crying? Why must you stop crying? What? You've gotten what you wanted. Yes! I'm just coming from Hugo's palace. Now! And he has ordered that they should leave my house. Huh? But listen to me! 
<laughs> let me tell you. Huh? Let me tell you. This woman and her children will surely leave this house. But whatever happens to them, the woman and her children has no definite destination. Whatever happens to them, their blood will be on your head. How many times have I said it? Hold up. Hold up, I'm following you. Go inside your mother's room. Leave her. Evil. Go! Go inside. Look at it. Mama. 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 Uh, are you okay? It's like you have fever. My daughter, I have everything. What have I not seen within this short period? Uh, I won't be surprised if, if I have AIDS too. Ha. Mama, don't talk like this. Don't talk like this. It's not the end of the world. Remember what the Bible says. That tears may endure through the night, but joy comes in the morning. Have faith in God, okay? Don't talk like this. Are you okay? What are, what happened? Are you crying? What happened? Did she beat you? I gave her a piece of my mind. My God. If only I can grow and become a man. I will tear and squeeze some people into pieces. God. God, why did you allow my father to die like that? God, what does he do to this about this? I wonder why the wicked ones live long, why the good ones die on time. What have my father done to this about this? Why did he have to die? God, why did you allow my father to die? God, why did you allow my mother to do God, why? God, why? Why did you allow my mother to die like that? What has he done to this God, why? God, why? God, why? God, why did you allow my mother to die? Jimbo! What has he done to this house? Papa, 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 God, hey! hey! God, 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 I do give you too much you want, you know. <laughs> Look at these nice girls. How for people like us. Hey, easy, easy. Ah, oh, bad. Oh, bad. Hmm. There's a drink for men. It goes round your body, then it Classes your nerves. <laughs> I think so. Yeah, I am. No, I am. I am. I think you got to go inside and show me what you have in three of you. <laughs> With own bar, I can do and undo. <laughs> What is it? 
You are brother is hardly present on the grave and you, you occupy this house. Well, I mean, I don't understand. Whether I stay out of the house for 10 years, 20 years, it's still the same thing. I am still the rightful owner to occupy the house no matter when. So I don't understand what we are talking about. Who are those girls? Don't call them those girls. Don't dismiss them, those girls. Those are my babes. You see, I'm trying to select to know the one that is suitable for me for marriage. That's all. <laughs> Alicia, Alicia, do you know what? Yeah. You are very, very stupid. I've known that so many years ago. Uh, Alicia, uh, at your age, your son is supposed to be 20 years or above. And now you are gallivanting, enjoying yourself. With all those little, little guests, you are supposed to be their father. So you are late in knowing. Where is your younger brother, mother? Oh, 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 Ichi. You've not heard what is happening. You caused it. You caused it. You killed your elder brother, Ijoko. Chased away his wife. Occupied his house. Now, you've made your younger brother mad. Alicia, he has been and he has Ichi, you are now making it look as if you are innocent. A saint, right? Hmm. The day I will open my mouth to tell this community you are atrocities, hmm. I swear they will either bury you alive or you will run away from this earth. <laughs> 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 it hasn't come to that. Let's allow everything that happened the night to be mosquito. You see, I was actually looking for you, so I went to your former house. It was there that I noticed you have already settled down to this place and just. <laughs> So what is it? Um, <laughs> Alice, you know our Igwe? What is wrong with Igwe? The man is very, very wicked. Oh yes. What did they do this time? Um, it's not something we'll discuss here. Let's get inside the house. Let's just get inside the house. Cannot do. There is nothing I cannot do. Just believe, and He will see you through. And no matter what you're going through, you're going to go. I just want to encourage you and to remind you that that God has been taking care of you since all this while. I've been in these tribulations. I've not abandoned you. Amen. That I've seen you through all this time of tribulations. He will continue to cater for you. Amen. He will provide for you. Amen. He will protect you. Amen. He will defend you. Amen. I assure you, Amen. you will lack no protection for him. Amen. Don't mind them. Hmm? Amen. You know, if he is to be in my hands, I would have allowed you to be here until you are tired of living with me. No, don't worry. You have tried. Thank you so much. God will bless you. I know it's not your fault. Igwe has ordered us to leave this place. We will go. Since I refused his offer to be his wife, as he said. Huh? Since then, uh, everything they said about me is true. Even uh, Iche, my husband's kinsman, the same thing. He supported Onodo and Adichie just because I refused to marry him. But there's no problem. No smoke without fire. No, I don't worry. Nobody knows tomorrow. Don't worry. I reckon. Oh, Let's go. I didn't know all this. Let's go. Mm. <laughs> That one day you will meet here and walk out. God will surely settle you evil men one by one. Hey! Iboko! Hey! Look at Iboko's children and the wife! <laughs>
Focus wife and the children. He focus wife and the children. Where are they going to carry him back? <laughs> He focus to everyone. <laughs> he. Do you know that Ali Jim, Ali Jim burned my farmland. He burned everything. For see me thinking that he will get me. No, no, no. <laughs> Ali Jim cannot get me. Ali Jim cannot get me. Do you know that Ali Jim killed him? Ali Jim killed him. Ali Jim and Ali Jim. They are the people that destroyed the Bokos family. <laughs> they destroyed everything. Do you know? <laughs> they are the people that fatted. Mama, did you hear that? That Ali Che killed our father. They are the people that spoiled the air in the Bokos family. Smelling, stinking. <laughs> poo, 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 poo. <laughs> oh, Ali Che cannot get me. Whatever a man sows, <laughs> so shall he rip it. <laughs> Wicked man. <laughs> You plus here. Yeah. You will go and you will die. You will go swipe and you will go children. I don't know you get married. I don't know you have a wife. Do you know that? He can only know not. I thought it. He can only know not. I thought it. There is nothing God cannot do. There is nothing God cannot do. Just believe and he will see you through And no matter what you're going through You know get you through Jerry will get you through Oh God in my There is nothing I cannot do He will surely see you through there is nothing God cannot do. He will surely see you through. Jerry no get you go. Jerry no get you go. No God in my Jerry no get you go. No God in my heart. Jerry no get you go. I miss your God in my there is nothing God cannot do There is nothing God cannot do Just believe and He will see you through And no matter what you're going through Jerry will get you good Jerry will get you good Oh God in my All is over. Remember, he knows your deepest cry. Just believe that whatever is over, that the Lord will surely see you. <coughs> My daughter, take this bread and this water. Then your brother should manage it. No? I know you people are hungry. Mama, I'm not happy. Is this what we're going to eat? Yeah, manage it. Please. Come on. Come on. I eat it. Okay? I'm okay. I'm not hungry. Are you sure you are not hungry? No, Mom, I'm not hungry. Just eat a little. Eh? I'm okay. No, man. Wake up. Eat now. Please. I said you should go and arrange for me. I may not ask this question again. If you want to marry a woman, you go and talk to her. Must I be the one to bring her to you, Igwe? And I said, go and do it. She's your king's woman. Tradition forbids that I should open my mouth and talk to a woman who is still more than her of bank. Hi! How can I tell her this type of thing, Igwe? Hi! Do you want the spirit of Iboko to come after me? 
which tradition. I am tradition myself. I am Digwe. My words are final. But you are the one who acts like I'm to chase her out of his house. Now, no, no one knows where she is. Including myself, I don't know where she is. Now listen. Leaving Akama's house does not mean you should go and hide her somewhere so that you alone will be seeing her. Or you think I don't know you are interested in you because why? Just go and get her from where you are hiding her. Hi! To God, if I don't know where she is. Please, leave me out of this. Swearing will not help you. You know where you get her. Of course you know no one says no to me. This is the last time I will make this request. Ah, yeah. Sorry. Ah, yeah. Sorry. 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 What is this now? Eh? What is this? Call on Kwakama. Okay, please manage. send his guys after you and they will just kill you off in the night. I suggest you stop sleeping in your house. Find somewhere else and sleep. Hey, the worst is that the man thinks I am hiding with you somewhere. Hey. And I suggest run away. Go on exile. Go to your room. 
I should run to my evening. My mother's people. Yes. Alicia, are you mocking me? Hey, 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 I will show you how I do it. 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 I will show you how I do Let me see what will happen. Will the heavens fall? 
Enough of this nonsense. It's okay, my, my dear. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Rebecca. Enough is enough. Stop crying. Huh? Please. Please, Rebecca. Please. Please. Huh? Please. 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 Huh? Don't drive yourself to my grave. I'm sorry. Please. It is so unfortunate that our sister, Muite Iboko, died due to a snake bite. From the depth of my heart, I plead with the kinsmen to take heart. These things happen once in a while. Just yesterday, a little from the same family was killed by his mad brother. Ite was there. So what? And so what? So because I was there, you expect me to stand before a roving madman who was chasing people around with cutlass? Is that what you mean? I didn't mean that. I mean, you could be a witness. Or are you feeling guilty of anything? Me? Feeling guilty? Guilty of what? Ite. You know your role. The part you played. Even with the letter bit. Come, come, come. What did I just hear you say? You talking to me. Stop opening your eyes on me. Lest I open my mouth and they expose you here. Because if I dare open my mouth here, I will not leave anything behind. I will say everything I know about you. Like I said earlier. All those that are behind the death of Wilton and that of her husband, um, you will book. Oh, they will pay their rent for their blood. Their blood will haunt them. Mm, but go ahead and open your mouth. Your mouth is just like a latrine. You, if, if you like, you open it wide. The whole world will just run away from you. Niche, Niche, I'm sorry for you. It's okay. Niche, I'm sorry for you. It's hard that you change. Change! You people who have come here, to run your mouth should know that my palace is not a market. That is a warning. Yes. Ezemo will be contacted on that. Even though I think there is no problem with that, on Alice's death, Ezemo will be contacted too. Because Aliche went and occupied his late elder brother's house when it is not yet time for him to do so. When atrocity hangs on a dead body, only the gods will tell us what to do. <laughs> I have spoken. And as I have said, so shall I. Yes. Iwe. Iwe. Nne, Ichi Akama asked me to tell you that the burial date will be fixed only after their meeting with Ezemo this evening. Yesterday they met at the palace and that is what they agreed. Will she be buried in my father's compound? I don't know, but that's what you're fighting for. No, that is what I don't want. Why? My father's compound is full of blood. I don't want my mother to be buried in a pool of blood. My dear, you have nothing to fear. Hmm? Custom and tradition must be followed. Hmm? Custom and tradition, my foot. Relax. We'll know what to do. It will be all right. Okay? Again, he asked me to come along with you to his house tomorrow. Why? He did not tell me. But I believe if we get there, we will know. It's all right, my dear. Have a wonderful night rest.
Nne. Rebecca. Your mother's brother has come to take you and your siblings to your mother's people at the Zekona. What have you to say? Isn't it wonderful? Isn't it wonderful that I'm only getting to know that my mother had a brother? The fact is that I... The fact is that all the while my mother was suffering, you were nowhere to be found. When her husband's people accused her, sent her packing out of her husband's house, said she killed our father, none of you came to her rescue. Even when my father died and he was being buried, none of you attended the burial. And now that my mother is dead, a total stranger sits before me and tells me that I should pick up my siblings and follow him to Zekuna. What do you want us to follow you to? Do I know who you are? I'm not a stranger to you, please. Take it easy. Um, Rebecca, forgive him. Huh? All the time he has lived all his life in the city, he just came back to Zekuna on retirement. Huh? Tell me that city people do not attend burials, right? In villages, they don't, they don't attend people's burials in villages. They don't attend burials. Or should I take it that such sympathy is only made for a time like this when my mother is no more? God, what a wicked world. Rebecca. Please, I'm not here to speak for your uncle. But... You know, sometimes what is meant to be said is never said completely. Some are left in the mouth for the teeth to chew. Please, please, understand. Forgive him, please. Rebecca, please. Forgive me, my daughter. <clears throat> nee, forgive me. Forget the past. Let's forge ahead. I was aware all this while. That's why I never showed up. Understand, please. <laughs> My daughter, are you following him to Zekona? Or are you staying here? The danger in staying here is that enemies talk a lot. When your mother came in here to live with me, with you people, they said, I wanted to marry your mother. Now that you're living with Onka, Onka is not married. Don't you think they can just rise up one day and say something funny? Yes. It's the truth. You know all they said when you were in uncle's house. How much more what they will say when they start about me. You know I'm still single. I'm not yet married. Please, understand what uncle is saying. And forgive him. Please. Please, Rebecca, please. Ne. I'm taking you people to Enzekona. That is the duty I owe to your mother and my sister. I will take care of you until the coast is clear. Mm. Ne. All I know is that my siblings and I are not going anywhere. Not until after my mother's burial. We're not going anywhere. It's all right. It's okay. It's okay, my daughter. Okay. 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 Thank you so much. Eh? Hmm? There is nothing I cannot do. He will surely see you through. There is nothing God cannot do. He will surely see you through. Jereno get you go. Jereno get you go. I didn't mind. Jerry, no,
Please, you see the way you insult me in this house, in the presence of those children, I don't like it anymore. Please, don't, don't ever try it again. Yes, ma. Which one is yes, ma? Yes, ma is yes, ma. Don't you know the meaning of yes, ma? Hey, Bobo, please, don't even go there. Don't insult me here. Ever since those, those children stepped their foot into this house, you've been insulting me, you've been giving them all the attention. Eh? Trying to insult me in every slightest chance. Why? Look at what you're saying. A boy was sick. All you could do was send him back to the farm. Look, let me ask you. When did you start farming? Farmer. Great farmer. Do your farm. Farm. But I've told you what I've told you. Don't do it next time. That insult is getting out of hand. I said don't do it next time. Whatever you suffer, that the Lord will surely see you through. It's not over till he says it is over. Oh God in my heart. Oh God in my heart. How are you feeling? Are you feeling better? Yes, I'm feeling better. Have you taken the drugs? Yes, I've taken the drugs, but I'm going to take the other ones after my meal at night. Okay. Thank God, though. Eh? Nah. Thank God. God will bless our uncle. You know that at least now you're falling sick when we have money to buy drugs. Without him, how will we even get money? You remember those days we were suffering with Mama? Did we ever fall sick? Hey! Wonders shall never end. Come. Were you not the one that said you were sick today? Were you not the one that was lamenting in the farm that you are sick? Auntie. So it's all about laziness. Auntie, he's sick now. Please let me talk. I will smash down your face. You are a lazy fool. No, Auntie, he's Ch no, shut up! Shut your trap. I wasn't talking to you. See, let me tell you something. You are a man. Tomorrow you will grow up. You will marry. You have your own children and wife to take care of. If you are not bored enough, you are not, if you are not man enough, you can't be able to feed them. Laziness, that is all about. That is what you are. You, you, are, you are just a lazy fool. You are here to take drugs. No, people came here to take drugs now. Eh, come to think of it. Did you wash the clothes I asked you to wash? But I was about washing them in the morning when you asked me to go to the farm. And so? Washing clothes before the farm. Or going to the farm before washing clothes. Are they not the same thing? Shut up! Eh? What is it? Why are you throwing words back at me? Who are you? In my husband's house? So I will talk and you will talk back at me, Abby? Or will please come and talk to her? What is it? Come and talk to her. I'm asking her something and she's throwing questions back at me. Who is she? In my husband's house? Huh? In my own husband's house? It's okay, it's okay. Rebecca, what is the problem? Uncle, I was about washing some clothes she gave me to wash in the oh, morning and then oh. she asked me to leave them and go to the farm. Now she's shouting No, at no, me. what's the meaning of this now? Oh, you're asking what? My co-wife, please tell her husband what happened today. Tell him now! It's okay. Why is it all the time we'll be hearing your voice? Don't talk, talk, talk. It's okay. It's okay. I will keep on talking. I will not close my mouth. I will keep on talking. Oh, yeah, keep on talking. Keep on talking. All the time. Talk, talk, talk. Nobody will hear something here. I want to hear something. You let come, hear. come, come. Why are you calling me back now? Are you not my wife? Come and sit down. Why, Fuko? Uh huh. I don't like the way you treat my sister's children. Rebecca here can be your daughter. You can have her as a daughter. Why did you send her to the stream when you know it will be lonely? Look, let me tell you. If anything happens to that girl, you'll be held responsible. Simple. Obu. What guilt are we talking about here? Eh? I'll be held responsible. For what now? Eh? Obu, let me ask you. So you cannot control this thing in between your legs? So you can't control your flesh? Anytime you, you, you hear this girl's name, you'll be running up and down. You'll carry your manhood and be, and be chasing her up and down. Obu, shame on you! Woman. Looking for her up and down. Then you talk rot out of your mouth. You talk rot. This is taboo coming out of you. It's a taboo. Taboo? Look, let me tell you. 
Do you know in your family, in your father's house, you are the most foolish woman I've ever seen? Foolishness should have been your middle name. You are a fool. Oh, thank you very much. But let me ask you something. Taking care of children in a family, whose responsibility is it? Is it not of a, of a woman? Oh, I'm happy you know. I no, no, you answer. I'm absolutely answer happy the question. You know. Is it not of the woman? Yes, I know. <laughs> so please allow me to take care of these children. Allow me to discipline them the way it should be. Mm. And you are the what wisest is... man in your family. What you, are the, you are the Solomon in this whole world. Foolish man. Madman, that is what you are. Foolish. Uncle, you're a good man, and we all know it. But your wife is not happy that we're here. My daughter, I want you to ignore her. No condition is permanent. One day, all this will be history. Hmm? Uncle, that is not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is that if we're the cause of your problems, then let us go. Let us go back to our father's house. Go where? Go back where? Go back to Isinjaba. Hi, God forbid. You want to go back to your home where they don't value people's life? No. Remember you are a girl. One day you will get married. And he left your brother. Listen, I want to take care of you and your brother. I want wherever my sister is, let her mind be at rest. I don't have problem. My children are in the city doing well. So what more? Uncle. But you people keep quarreling every day. I just feel that we're the cause of your problems. I just, I just feel guilty. I don't want to cause you any problem. No, it's okay. I am used to her madness. It's nothing to me. I've seen all these things she's been doing. I've been years. I've been enduring it. Huh? I want you to understand one thing: that one day, these are stories you will tell your children. That these are the things you pass through in life. By the way, where is your brother? He, he went out. He went out to play. No Thank problem, you, eh? <sighs> Woman. Woman. I've never seen. No woman. No crime. This is what has been happening, Eva. So this is what has been happening. You are here planning how you go and eat and eat the important pure now. And I'm coming. You saw that I was coming. You tried to corner it so that you guys would deceive me. But I'm sharper than you now. I'm sharper than you. No, there's nothing like that. Shut, 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 shut up. Don't touch her. What are you talking about? You don't know. So you don't know. You should be ashamed of yourself. You should be ashamed of yourself. So this is what you've been doing. Shut up! Shut up! I know it now. You have eaten that thing. You have tested it. That is what gave what gave you the boldness, the nerve to talk back. That is it now. Uh, Rebecca, please go and see your brother. Huh? Okay. I will see you later. Oh, you <laughs> Oh, he said you should go so that he will come and meet you later. I said it now. You've been eating from the pan of yam. So this place, you are not afraid of it, eh? Afraid of what? What? What will I be afraid of? What are you talking about? I didn't do anything. What? <laughs> Shut up, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Don't you get away in my house. What is shame on you? What? Shame! What? I'm ashamed of yourself! What will I be ashamed of? I'm crazy! He said he's your sister's uh, daughter. Uh -huh. Am I right? Yes. And you're touching everywhere. So, you are not touching my friend. I will, every uh, time you play. You will regret why in my every house. Every time you touch. Touch me. You hurt this one. Me. You think me. I don't know. You, you think I don't see. Shame on you. Shame on what? Shame. 
It's your sister. What My are you, what are you sister's daughter. Are you? And you're touching everywhere. You touch here. You touch here. You catch here. You think I didn't see you. Shame! Look at what you are saying. Shame! Don't you know you are a married woman? Are you husband? Huh? Look, look are you a husband? You, are talking to you call yourself like a husband? Then what am I? Tell me you what are what horse. I am. The band is not there. You are just a horse, no band. Then why do you complain Shame. at times? Shame! Why do you complain at times? Shame! Complain for what? You see, one day I will cut this thing and throw it out. If you touch it, you regret why you are married. Don't, don't, don't provoke me or say I will, not, I will not just pack all these things and touch it. I will bury you right here now. Don't allow me to, to pack all these try things. It. You try it. If something is wrong with you, try it. I don't like what you are doing here. You know, if you keep on listening to this woman, you're going to die on time. Imagine. Imagine that woman suspecting me of having something to do with her husband. Imagine. Just imagine. Come on, she said it. But has it happened? Don't allow this woman attitude to change your mood. You know that's what she wants. And she slapped me. Polika, she slapped me. What did I do? Did you not see her slap me? Did I do anything wrong? What kind of word is this? Polika, I beg you, in the name of God, let us live here. Let us go. Let us pack our things and go. What did I do? Did I do anything to her? What have I seen in this life? Polika, please. Let us go. Let us pack our things. Go here. Is it because of the stupidity of my wife that will make you leave your uncle's house? No, never. She has sworn that you people will leave this house, but I said no, it can never happen. Understand? I said you are not going anywhere. She cannot make decisions for me. Where is she? I noticed that this problem started the very first time we came here. I saw her mood. She was in a solemn mood. Listen, Polika. I am the lord of this house. Whatever I say goes. She has no right to make any decision for me. I said it and I capitalized the word. You people are not going anywhere. Understand? <laughs> what have I done to deserve this? I said I don't no, no, I am the lord of this house. Nobody will decide for me. Understand? It's okay, it's okay. It's okay, stop crying. If you cry like this, I will not be happy. Yeah? My dear, do you know that when I slapped Rebecca, my husband nearly replied the slap? Hmm? Honestly, to God, I don't know what to do. I don't really know what to do. You made a terrible mistake. How? There are better and faster ways to show your anger. How do you mean? I mean you would have taken something like a, a, a rat poison or probably jump into a Bineke river. If you had died once and for all, you wouldn't be sitting here. What kind of stupid advice is this? Listen, let me tell you the truth. The only mistake you ever made in life was not accepting Rebecca and her brother. Your husband continuously mourns the death of the only sister, and you know it. Because their father's people are too fetish and hateful. Let me ask you something. How do you think you can separate your husband from the late sister's children? How? See, I, I thought that you have better things to say. I never knew you were going to say all this stupid talk. Huh? Mm -hmm. Anyway, I don't blame you because you are not civilized. If you had lived in the city, you wouldn't have been saying all these things. I know. Huh? You know what I was trying to prevent. <laughs> I may not have lived in the city before like you, but what I have in this, my local brain, is more better than this wicked head of yours. Hey. Yes. See, I thought 
I was thinking if I came here, if I come here, you will just tell me how to, you know, do something. Something like a small food. How? Shut it now. Just to separate them. That's all. You want to do food against your husband's sister's children? Hey! To fear again? No. Oppo must hear this. Mbano. Mbano. Sit down, sit down. Hey, my friend. Yeah? I was only joking. <laughs> Are you sure you were joking? I was only joking with you. You know, at times, but this is my lips, eh? you be running like this. I was Are only joking. Sure? No, I was only joking. <laughs> Jay, I didn't mean it, honestly. I you know that. Yes. Mm -mm. mm -mm. uh, okay, so, uh, I'm sorry. What can I get for you? Any distance, anything cold. <laughs> Just for understanding me, eh? Ah, no, 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 when are you? Babu! Where is that? What? Why are you being sure? What is it? If you know how to protect your late sister's children, you better do so today and tomorrow. There's a snake under the grass. Snake under the grass? Yes. Snake? Your wife came to my house this morning and reported that you almost slapped her because of her Polonia. She said that ever since you brought your late sister's children into the house, that you no longer gave her, gave her attention at all. Did she tell you she accused me of sleeping with my sister's daughter? What? I don't know what I will tell that woman. I just don't know. That woman is planning to go to native doctor's house. <laughs> because of your sister's children. I want you to be at her heart. Her anger was that I did not support her. I was rebuking her. She thought I would accompany her to that place. And I said no. Eh? I don't know what to tell that woman. Oh. So it has come to the means of using native medicine. Obu, you not tell me that. She... See, uncle, let's just don't hide anything. Let's tell ourselves the truth. After all, there is solution to every problem. You know, I don't know anybody in this Ezekona land. I know, but sister, I'm begging you for one favor. Please, can we come to your place and stay? Malika, what is the meaning of this? Uncle, you know our lives are at risk. It's not that we won't be coming to visit you, but at least let's run away from this problem, Uncle. Please, let's stay in our house. Where is my wife? That one. I left her in my house. That woman can kill. Fear what? Hmm? Well, I heard what the boys said. They can come and stay with me. I will accommodate them. Hmm? Because it's better for somebody to stay where the person's heart will be at rest. Thank you. You think we don't know? You think we don't know that you went to native doctors as to collect you these kilos? You will never those. succeed. I'm not one of those primitive women that do practice fetish. Uh, Obu, are you back? I said, uh, are you back? Go inside. We can't. Finished. Who told them? How did they know? Hey! Who knew one day? I can't see you. Hey! I'm going to miss you. What is the meaning of this? Who pushed down my throat? Where are these ones? What is happening here? Who put down this road? You will not know. You don't know. Fire, lift it up. Lift this thing up now. I say lift this up. You will not know. My friend, get out from there.
What is happening? Self for the aged mother in the city. I don't know if you can still contact him. But you told me uh, you have nobody that could be taken to the city for somebody to stay with somebody. Indeed, my brother, I said so. I was thinking my wife could cope with my sister's children, but I was wrong. If you come to my house now, it's like five. Huh? Uh -uh. Why are women like this? They find it very difficult to accommodate other women's children. Why? It is wickedness. What oh. accommodation problem? Anyway, let us not go into that to talk about my wife. I just want a place where Rebecca will stay and have rest of mind so that my wife will not kill her. Has it gotten to that? It is serious. Huh? Can you get me his number? Well, I can. Uh, um, in this time of uh, GSM, I think it's easy to connect him. I will give you his number. Uh, but then, have you talked to your sister's daughter? Because he told me about a girl, not a boy. No problem about that. Uh -huh. I will speak with her. Fine. My children are in university over there in Soka. They cannot accommodate them. I just want a place where Rebecca will have rest of mind, please. Ago, can you help me? You don't have problem. The man is very rich. They are very wealthy. They are even looking for somebody they will employ on salary basis. And you know, this will suit uh, Rebecca. Uh -huh. So you don't have problem. Thank you, God. Thank you. Is that so? Yes, yes. Please, can you give him his number? Yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Let me call him. The number is 80 Your mother asks you to think of him always. But she never asked you to breastfeed him. He is a grown up young man. Uncle, in order to settle this case, do they need a boy? Let me go. No, 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 no. Yeah. They want a girl just Rebecca's age. Uncle, uh, seriously, I don't know what to say. I don't know what, what to say until tomorrow. Let me sleep over this. Let me think about it. No problem. It's okay, huh? Okay. What are you thinking about? It's better you say it now. Let's know where we stand. No, allow her. She has every right to think. 
Rebecca, think about it, yeah? Just sleep over it, no problem. Uncle me, I don't like this. I don't like it all. Valika. Valika. Yeah. 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 Just be respectful. I like the family. It's a kind family. They will surely take care of you. Hmm? I don't want you to put up that sad look. It's okay. <sighs> yeah. All he's saying in effect is that all you need is to be respectful. Obedient. You don't have problem anymore. Including that they will be paying you your salary. They will be paying you. I know these people. They are very generous, kind. So they have been doing this to other children. So you won't be an exception. Please, just be respectful, that's all. Yeah? Ole, please don't cry. Okay? I, it, it hurts me that I have to leave you. I don't want to leave you and go anywhere. But situation warrants that I leave. But I promise you something. I will surely come back to take you along with me, okay? Don't cry. Ubu, I'm thank you very much. I love you. I'm absolutely. When you cry, it seems like all is over. Remember, he knows your deepest cry. Just believe that whatever you suffer. That the Lord will surely see you through It's not over till he says it is over Oh God in my 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 Nine. I've been planning to tell you this, and I think this is the perfect time. Nine, for the past four days, you've been in my house. When you came, I thought you wanted to pass a night. Hi. But you know the way things are for me. Eh? You know my condition. Nay, how is things for you? Four days. And the look of things, you are not even planning to leave tomorrow. Huh? Nay, let me ask you. Am, am, am I the one that, that, that sent the spirit of, of, of the dead people to chase you away from your house? Why are you talking like that? You know, it could happen to anybody any day. Eh? My son, please. Eh? Nay, condition or no condition, you have to go. I am single. Eh? Nay, I am single. The girl I want to marry no longer come to my house. All because of your presence. Ooh. Did she tell you I am responsible? Hey, eh? <laughs> hey, uh, uh. hey! Oh, no, no, my son, please. <laughs> I, I'm not disturbing you people from doing what you know. And then, you know, <laughs> from enjoying yourself. <laughs> Nine. You have to. Find a way and go back to your house. Because if by tomorrow you are still here, I'll be forced to lock my door.
morning, sir. Good morning. Um, please, I'm looking for my sister. She says she's coming to this house to see someone. There's nobody here. I, uh, I live here with my sister, Philo and Fred. Ah, okay. What's your own name? My name is Rebecca. Really, <laughs> ma? Sorry, excuse me. That's my sister's name as well. And I like calling her that name. Do you like the name? Mm, it's okay now. It's okay. My name is Johnny. I'm with the back of so I'll... Rebecca, are you still here? No, he, he, he's looking for somebody, so I was just trying to give him direction. Come on, go and bring what they say you should bring. Go and bring noodles. Sorry, sir. They sent her there. Which one is it in waking? I'm sorry, I was not talking to you. I was talking to myself. Please, I'm disturbing me. I want to sleep. Uh uh. Really? Um, excuse me, there's this girl that comes to the shop every now and again to buy something. She lives in that duplex there. Yes. Um, she's always coming here to buy something. What's her name? There are two ladies that live in that duplex. Um, Rebecca and Philo. Yeah, Rebecca. Oh, That's the one I'm asking you about. That one that doesn't know anything. What do you mean she doesn't know anything? She was brought from the village not too long ago and she's just trying to cope with city life. I think you're right, but she is so innocent, yeah. and that's what I like. Don't be deceived. That's timidity. She doesn't know anything. You know what? Just wait. Take this for the trouble, okay? Yeah. Please, when you see her next, tell her Johnny. Ask of her, okay? Ah, Get a number for me so I can reach her. I'll okay? That. Thank, right. you thank you. Yeah. Here. I should watch this clothes. I should watch this clothes. Yes. So what will you be doing when I wash the clothes? Can you imagine? What do you mean I should go and wash this clothes? What do you mean? So if your madam asks you to wash this clothes, you won't wash it. You're not madam. You cannot tell me what to do. Okay. For now, I'm your madam. Take. Philo! Philo, you cannot tell me to wash this clothes alone. You shake it to half. You wash one and I wash one. I Are you mad? Hey, wash one and wash one. Why can't you be telling me to go and wash clothes? Look at this village girl. Go and buy me some job. Look at this village girl. I'll tell madam what you're doing. I'll tell madam what you're doing. I'll tell madam what you're doing. Village girl, look at her legs. 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 Look One guy came today, he said his name is Johnny. Is that boy that calls me Riri Wow. Okay, he said that when next you come, you should drop your number. No, I don't have phone now. Oh, okay, okay, don't worry. I'll, I'll give you a um, philo phone. Give me change. <laughs> okay, thank you. Hello? Hello, who is this? Please, um, who are you and who do you want to talk to? It's me, Johnny. Am I talking to Rebecca? No. Do you want to talk to Rebecca? Yes, please. Okay, hold on, let me call her. Rebecca! Rebecca! 
You know I really like you. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Please talk quick, oh. talk quick before Philo catch me here. Okay, okay. What do you want from here? I'll buy it for you. Anything. Hmm? Look, oh. Just look, oh. Look, oh, Zed. <laughs> okay, no problem. Shopkeeper, please give her look, oh, Zed for me, eh? Yeah? Lele, ma. I like this your smile though. <laughs> so when will I see you again? Hmm? Tell me. Thank you. Ah. Okay. Uh, how much is my money? Two hundred. Huh? Take care. Rebecca, Ma. where are you coming from? Um, from the desert, from the shop opposite the house. Ma. Shop opposite the house. And who is the owner of that local zone? Ma? Who is the owner of that local zone? Who is the owner? Yes, ma. I sent out to buy you. Yes, yes, yes madam. I sent out to buy you local Z. You see the two of you in this house, eh? I know how to handle you. Oh yeah, bring it here. You, you. I, 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 I know how to handle you. The two of you, yes. Get away from here. Please. That man that called you on my phone yesterday. Mm. You better tell that man to stop calling you. Or else you make Madame push you out of here. Hello? Please, please stop calling this line. Do you want Rebecca to be sacked? Please stop calling her, please. Who was that? Is that same man now? Philo? He says he likes me a lot. That he likes really you. likes me. That he likes you. And you believe him? Please. Eh? That man is lying to you. Men are so dangerous. They are deceitful. Don't mind him. Okay. Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> hey, I've heard what you people said. You know I'm not her parents. I will try and let the parents know. No problem, I will understand that. We only came to let you know my intentions, me and my friend. Yeah. Maybe you can help us to pass the message across to them. Okay. How am I even sure that uh, Rebecca is interested in this marriage before we start talking about the parents? Hmm? Maybe we'll find out from Rebecca and see what she feels. Let me Rebecca! Rebecca! You know this young man. Hey! Madam! I used to see him. He used to come around the gates. Don't be scared. He said he wants to marry you. Me? No! Please, Mama, Mama, they, they don't come here to marry you. I came here to, to walk. Please. I came here to walk. <laughs> really? Really? You know I love you. And I want to marry you for real. Please, leave me alone. Please, leave me. Please, leave me alone. <laughs> I told you, she's still a small girl. But hmm? well, don't worry, I'll be. I'll let the parents know. Hmm? Please, please do that for us. I will, I will. Hmm? Thank you, drink. finish your drink. Oh, okay, no, thank, thank you. Fine. Thank you very much. Yes, madam. And uh, Rebecca. Yes, madam. Fred. Yes, ma'am. You know the month has ended. And I want to comment on the way you people served this month. I'm really grateful. Hmm? You people tried very well. Especially this new one. You tried very well. Thank you. And, <laughs> and the philosopher to be teaching her. Okay? Try your best. Huh? She tried very well. Thank Didn't you. Even do as, uh, Thank you. Person. And you, Fred, you tried very well. Thank you. Mm -hmm. This is your monthly salary. This is your Thank you, madam. This one is yours. Thank you, madam. And uh, this is yours. Thank you, madam. And uh, again, try to use it very well. Don't misuse it. Hmm? Yes, uh, don't misuse it. Thank you. Madam, sorry to disturb you. Well, I was wondering uh, since, since I got my salary, uh, well, I would like to, to go to the village. My younger brother is there. I want to buy something for him and make him happy. And I want to see them because it has been very long. I went to the village. I will not stay long. Okay. I will give you permission to go from tomorrow and come back in three days' time. Thank you. God will bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you. I 